Hey guys, welcome back to my YouTube channel. My name is Kamkhalo Mutusi. I am back with yet another video. Today we'll be talking about business funding or business financing. You might be someone who has a business idea but you don't have the funds to start it up or you are someone who already has a business but you don't have enough money to keep it going. If you are that person that this video is for you. And if you are somebody who is not subscribed yet, I must tell you, you are missing out on a lot of opportunities. Please hit that subscribe button and join this family of opportunities. Let us start with a quick reality check. Like many things in business, business funding depends on your specific needs. It might depend on the growth stage of your business, or it might depend also on the resources that you need to keep that business going or any other factors that you might think of. So for example, if you are, or you have an ongoing business, you obviously qualify to go to a traditional bank and to ask for, for a business loan. For example, if you have a startup business, you obviously do not qualify because you have no record to show the bank that you are able to repay them. So it's very important for you when you're looking for funding that you look at the right channels, you look at the right opportunities. What is it that you qualify for as a startup business? For startup businesses, for example, if you are a high growth startup business, there might be investors that are interested into putting money into your project, putting money into your innovation. So any kind of business, whether you're studying, whether you're an um, ongoing business, you are all winning. But it's all about looking in the right channels and making sure that you get that funding the right way. Today we'll be talking about NYDA. NYDA stands for National Youth Development Agency. It is a program that has been designed to provide the youth with financial and non-financial support so that they can establish their businesses. Remember, to run a successful business, you do not only need money. You need more than money to run a successful business. And that is what NYDA will be providing you with. They provide you with mentorship. They also provide you with a business consultancy, with business management training course, and also with market linkage. Let us go through the qualifying criteria. You must be youth between the ages of 18 and 35. You must also be a South African resident. You must have a business that is registered and operating in South Africa. You must be able to prove that you have attended business management training course. If you haven't, they offer that course themselves so you can register to go through that as well. You must also submit all the required documents you must also have a necessary skill or experience in the business that you want to start. You must also be able to tell them how your business will tackle social and economic issues in the community. There is a form, there's a section in the form where you'll get to write all about that. Let us talk about the money part of it. How much will you be getting or how much will you be funded for? The funding will depend on what stage your business is at. If your business is at an idea generation stage, then you qualify for 1,000 rand to 10,000 rand. And if you are on the startup stage, you qualify for 10,000 rand to 50,000 rand. If you are on the growth stage or the growth phase of your business, you qualify for 50,000 rand to 100,000 rand. And if you are on the expansion stage, you qualify for 100,000 rand to 200,000 rand. And one thing to note, if you are someone who is into agriculture or technology related business, you qualify to, for up until a maximum of 250,000 rand. But 
If you are in this range, please be sure that you fill in the correct process because it's going to be different from the above four that I just spoke about. The most important thing, guys, is a business plan. I cannot stress this enough. Out of all the required documents that you'll be submitting, a business plan is the most important one. And if you are having difficulties here and there with drafting your business plan, you can simply go to their branches. There are people that are willing to help you there for free, right? And it's quicker for you to go to the branch than to apply online because there you get all the information. When you get stuck, they are able to help you and be able to show you what is required, what is missing, so that you don't have to keep going back and forth. These people, they are there for you. They are waiting for you to come with your business plans, with your business ideas, so that they can help you. There is literally money allocated for youth to improve youth's lives. So you want to make sure that you take this opportunity while you still can, while you're still between the ages of 18 and 35, to go and find out all of this information and let them help you. Thank you guys for watching up until this end. If you watched up until this end, please make sure to go down on the comment section down below and comment with the letter green. Just type in green, then I'll know that you watch up until this end. I have a giveaway coming up. Um, I'll tell you more about it as time goes. I have a giveaway that I am only willing to give to people that are really supporting this channel, people that are watching the whole video. So if you comment green, then I will know that you are really the real G. So keep watching guys. I really love you to successful businesses. Bye.